Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome if you are new. So this is a popcorn card. So when this video goes up, it is National Popcorn Day. And I didn't even know how many holidays there really was. Like there are so many. So I've decided that each month I am going to pick out a couple from my calendar because my calendar has all these national holidays written into them. Um, and basically I'm going to post... Um, like a graphic of all the themes that are going to be done that month with the dates and then if you want to participate you can um, you don't have to participate in every single theme um, or every single month you know you can just come in and do the ones that you can do you know and I think it's just a great way of keeping your creativeness going especially I know a lot of people especially like in January especially I find that people just struggle with like what to create do they carry on making christmas cards do you carry on making winter theme cards or do you go on to the next holiday which is valentine's day you know there are so many things where january just seems to drag and i feel like january feels like the longest month even though logically it's not because there are so many like little days that we celebrate in december that when january comes around and there's nothing to break it up or to celebrate it just seems to drag way too much so so yeah, happy and National Popcorn Day. So when this video goes up, I will probably be having a movie night and having some popcorn. So also let me guys know what your favorite popcorn is. Mine personally, I used to love toffee popcorn, but I started to actually just love salt and sweet popcorn. Um, to be quite honest, I no longer actually do um, microwave popcorn. I've I didn't even know like why I stopped doing it I just think maybe I didn't like it anymore maybe it was like because it's so easy to burn in a microwave I'm not entirely sure but I do have a little trick so if you guys buy the microwave bags where you put you basically take them out of the plastic foil and then you put the paper bag into the microwave if when you take your, uh, your popcorn out instead of pulling like the bag apart like you normally would to open it Open it a little bit, not a lot so that everything can fall out, but just tip it upside down and shake out and you'll find all the little mini popcorn kernels that haven't popped yet. And then that way you don't have all these popcorn kernels at the end of the bag where you've wasted. So that's a little trick for you guys. Um, but yeah, everything I used is going to be linked in my description for you guys. Um, so originally I didn't know what this card was going to be made for. Um... I am thinking of recreating it though because I have another idea for another card so in February I'm going live again and I put up a poll on my Instagram to find out you know what was the most popular day for me to go live what the best time was all of that sort of stuff and at this present moment the last time I checked it has been the most popular day is Friday and the most popular time is at quarter past um, four um p.m which is british standard time so that makes it oh i'm trying to remember off the top of my head i think it makes it like 10 15 a.m eastern standard time and 8 15 a.m pacific standard time i think that's what it is um so if you do guys i'd love to have you join um and every card that we create in the live it tends to be given as a giveaway so all you've got to do is watch the live and you know comment through the video at some point just you know, ask a question, you know, just basically anything really, just say something in the chat and you'll probably get entered into it. So yeah, I actually started doing this last year um, and I haven't done any lives since December. My last one was the week before Christmas, before I got really ill and everybody I've, you know, in a group that I'm with have all asked me like, oh, when are you going live again? I kind of miss it. And I didn't realize how many people actually did miss it because like, you know, you wouldn't really think much about it with it being only a month of me not doing it. So the reason I haven't gone live in January is basically because I wanted to reset my craft room. So you will have seen videos gone up of me cleaning my craft room. And basically, I just want to get it organized instead of having just things piled everywhere and, you know, so I also have a lot of stuff that I'm selling that obviously has been in my craft room for as long as I can remember and I've just not used it. You know, I need to start 
doing this with myself if I haven't used it by the end of a year then it most likely means I'm never going to use it and to get rid because obviously I'm running out of space and that's one of the main reasons my craft space is always messy is just because I don't have enough room for all of my supplies. So with that being said I have posted it over on a Facebook group called UK Buy and Sell Crafting. Um, so that's where it's going first. And then after a week, if nothing's sold over there, then I'm going to post it on my Instagram. So if you guys want anything and you're from the UK, then make sure you go and check out that that post. Um, I think it's going to go in my story highlight box. So it'll be listed as something along the lines of selling or sale items. I don't really know yet, but yeah. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoy this video. And if you do, make sure you hit that thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already. It really means a lot. So one of my personal goals for this year is to hit, I want to say 600 subscribers. I'm not going to go too far because at the minute we're at 465, I believe. So it's not that many. I was hoping to hit 500 by the end of December of 2023, but obviously it didn't happen. Um, but I think another reason for that being is because I have not been, you know, pushing it as much as I normally would. Like I posted a couple of times and you know, it's just not something I've been like reaching for a lot. So like I used to message people, you know, say, oh, if you support me, I'll support you. And that's how I met a lot of my crafting friends. So I might have to go back into doing that and just getting some people to subscribe. But yeah, that's pretty much it. I'm going to insert some music. I'm going to speed the process up and I will talk to you guys in my next video. I can't remember what it is. I know it's going to be another hop at some point. Um, I'm also part of another hop group, which is, if I remember, on the 19th or the 21st, it's one of those. So I need to make that card thinking about it. But yep, that's pretty much it. And I'm going to go have a great week and I'll see you guys in the next one. Hurt me Just think about it Think about it But you hold me Like you don't want